These guys take a fair amount of encouragement to get down here. Get, get down there. Get, go, go, go. No, don't, don't. Turn around. Turn around. Get in there. Get it. There we go. Okay. Now time for the long and arduous process of sniping everybody again, which I think I will jump cut through. Seems like there are only half of them out here. Oh, wait. There's the other one. Okay. I thought there were more of these guys. At about. It's kind of hard to tell. So we've got two axe guys on the ground. I've got all of the barrel dudes in the mix. Is there like another one down over there? No. Interesting. Oh, that's where he is. Hmm. I wonder if I can... Nope. Damn. Ah. He's in position, though. Nope. He's not in position. Now he's in position. And I upgraded the short bow, so it actually does a fair amount of damage now. I'm also wearing the dexterity ring, considering we currently have no souls. So there's really no reason for me to uh, be wearing a ring of life protection. Right? I mean, sure, there's like that modicum of health, but that's not that important to me. My hope is that the little exploder guys will get close enough that Sir Lava Shoulder Pads, wow, actually do twice as much damage to him now. Give or take. But uh, these guys are going down a hell of a lot faster than the last time, but I'm hoping Lava Shoulder Pads is going to turn, blow up one of the barrel dudes, and then I don't have to worry about it. Otherwise, we're going to have an awkward time of it. Nope. Not it. Come on, turn, blow him up. Because I know he takes fire damage. I'm cheating here. Come on, God. so close. I should get a fire bow at some point. Unfortunately, the only bow that I have other than this is the bellkeeper bow. Really? Really, you're going to do this to me? Okay, so essentially we've got a bunch of boom barrel guys running around. We've got that dude ski up there ski. And apart from that, uh, not much. Here's the question. Do I have fire arrows? I might, actually. I have lacerating arrows, iron grade arrows, poison arrows. I do have fire arrows. Okay. Let's just, uh... How that... How do you... Switch? Nope. Holy crap! That, that was 2,000 damage straight to his face. Well, let's just wait for this to happen, because there's another one going for him. Just gotta, you know, be patient. Nope. That was a fire arrow. That was wasteful. But that was a fire arrow. How do you... What if it's this? No? I really don't know. Well, I mean... We could go in and try and deal with them. The problem is, if that does 2,000 damage, that's more than enough to kill me if one of those boom barrel guys goes off directly next to me. So I'm really just hoping that he kills himself, and then, well... Then just everything becomes easy. He's so close. Like, look at him! Look at him! Just, just, just do it. Just do it, man. You know you want to. You know you want to go boom. Man, this sucks. Okay, so let's unequip the fire arrows. I don't even know where to buy them. And it'd be kind of stupid of me to just waste all my money on arrows that I cannot replenish my stocks of. Come on, move your cankles into position. There we go. Wow. He is really injured. I actually have a half a mind to go down there and fight him, except for the boom barrel guys. Eh, you know what. Let's just kill the boom barrel guys. Why am I using... Lightning arrows to deal with them? Okay, there's one. And... Wait. Really? No. It was close. It was very close. For a second there, I thought we had actually blown up the other guy. Because there's, like, a lot of screaming and whatnot. Anyway. Let's see if that's close enough. Damn. Nope. Well, I guess it's time to go pay the piper. And by pay the pi piper, I mean uh, pickle a pepper. And hope for the best. Let's just hope that uh, Comandante across the way is a little bit less explosive happy this time around. At least long enough for me to kill this guy. Sup, chump. Oh, nope. Looks like he is just as explosive happy as ever. I wonder if I get closer. Wait. Now, I believe he really only needs two more hits. Death. Okay, there he's gone. And for some reason, he turned white. Don't really understand that bit. Now, let's see if I can get... Oh, those are fire columns. Come on. I'm just down here. Ah, there he is. Called it. And death to the infidels. I'm not entirely sure why he qualifies as an infidel. Let's get... Nope, nope, nope. Holy shit. That hurt. Oh. 
did not want to stay close to that. Woo! Whew. Okay, fast. Use smelter wedge. Go. Die. You'd think that thing would react more to me exploding it. Oh, it has a head. That's a lady. That would explain why it's a uh, soul of Nadalia, Bride of Ash. Whew. You know, all this kind of sucks more when you're like 30 levels too low for an area. Let's pull the lever and look around. Because, uh, well, scary things. Potentially. Maybe not. Maybe so. I have no idea. Look and look and look and nobody's here. That's good. Some dead corpses down there. Oh, that's a thing. Oh, it's one of these guys. Hmm. Okay, so we all know how to deal with one of these guys. Rotation is your friend. Ow! Rotation hurts. Life gem. Rotate faster. God damn it. He really did not get my shield up there. Either that or his fire damage is just really substantial. Head around the corner. Estus. Roll! Don't die. Okay. Uh, shit. Okay, this is a good time for an Estus. Why was this guy so much easier earlier? Okay, we'll just use the infinite... Re infinite rotation to our advantage. Unfortunately, it does fire damage, which is uh, so useful against us. Now he's going to come up for a strike? Nope. Well, he kind of does. But not yet. Okay. <laughs> Why is everything so scary and hateful? I wonder if I could back attack him. That seems like a terrible idea. I guess regular strikes are adequate enough. Just gotta, you know, get him when he's Hopefully down. Come on, come on. Oh, maybe he only does that strike when he's... You know what? Fuck it. I guess that works. Okay, so, at this point we now have enough souls to justify wearing a ring of life protection. Also, uh, we really don't need that much dexterity for anything, so let's just go down here and hope. Human effigy. Wow. Twinkling Titanite. Wow. Dried root. Uh, and large titanite shard. <laughs> Noise effects. Sound effects. Let's look at this place while we're here. Wow, we're actually getting pretty low to the bottom, I assume. Not to mention, how the hell did we get here? I thought the old iron keep was high up. Wow. Actually, this landscape seen better days. Wait, oh, right, we got teleported. So, in fact, we are no... What the... Okay, so that is a caster. That is a caster that hurts. And that... Sp uh, that bowcaster dude is probably... Aw, oh, shit. This is gonna end poorly for me. Wow, oh, shit. Going for a strike. And die. Damn. Note to self. Lightning chuckers. Don't trust them. Duh. Hopefully I don't have to kill good old fire shoulder pads a second time around. I really hope not. Let's go stick our head out and see see if that's the case. I'm going to be a wee bit on the cross side of things if he's there again. Well, in retrospect, big old baddie is not visible. He might actually be one of the only like truly unique mobs in this game. Either that or he's hiding in the dorm frame. Neither of which I'm particularly keen on. Now this does present some interesting complications for us. AKA that guy up there can conceivably blow us to hell. Let's uh, go over here, look at that door. Oh shit, that's where he is. What the hell is he doing? I'm hoping that uh, this guy pops down before Fire Shoulder Pads decides to come say hi. Looks like he's stuck out there. Come on. Come on. I don't want to have to fight both of you. What the hell is he doing? I guess he hangs out over there. Come on. Just gotta... Oh, he's getting closer. Oh, oh what the fuck? Come on. Okay, well, there we go. We got that problem solved. And there's the next problem. <laughs> wow. Usually I don't record myself fighting enemies twice. Wait. Hold on. Hold horses. 
Blow up, blow up. Got him. Yeah, got him. Take that, mister. Oh, shit. Okay, next up. Let's see if I can get the next one over. Come on, Mr. Croaks. Where the hell's the other ones? Go, go. Go, 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 go. Go, go, my suicide minions. Go, go, go. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. All right, so uh, we took it care <laughs> of that guy. Hell of a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Sweet. Note to self, do that next time. Do that forever. Because, man, that was fun. Okay, so... Is this guy just permadead? No, he's not. There he is. Hmm. All this does present some interesting complications that I do not want to deal with, but I'm going to have to come to, uh... Holy shit, that, that has a lot of range. Uh, hmm. I don't think I can stun this guy either. Nope, can't stagger him. That's the problem. I'm really hoping I could stagger him, because that would make my job a hell of a lot easier. Well, guess not. Guess I just gotta... Be patient. Be patient. Get my stamina back. Get my stamina back. Go around this guy. Wait for him to do his thing again. What the hell are you doing, Mr. Dude? Come on, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. What the heck are you doing? I kind of want a sword. There we go. Note to self. Use quick attacks. They're much more effective at damaging hit in this scenario. Okay, so we took a little bit of damage there, but in the end, doesn't matter. We got plenty of health, and men, we cleared that area a hell of a lot faster than the last time. So, uh, enough of the hell of us. Time for some success stories. Inst okay, so we've got uh, Mr. Lightning Snipes. Let's just scoot around the ridge here, and I believe those lightning spells home in. I'm more than willing to bet that. However, how do they feel about arrows? Damn, he has a lot of health. I mean, essentially, just does not take a lot of damage from a lightning. Hmm. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to equip my shield. I'm going to run here. Not get hit by that. Okay, I've pissed off the dudes. Now back to running. Back to running, 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 running. Okay. Please. Okay, it's coming after me. Oh, shit, there's more. <laughs> well... <laughs> Looks like it's a good thing I, uh... Hmm. What are you doing? Get back here. Chump Lords. One and two. What the bips are you doing? That's like four of them. Please, just you. Um. It does come further, right? Nope. Guess not. So, we know how to deal with this situation. Wait for the lightning spells to abate a little bit. Oh. Use this guy to block the spells for us. Nope. That's not blocking the spells. They go straight through him. That is such a jerk. Just keep backing off. Yeah, well, at the very least, he tanks the spells somewhat. Oh, and my arrow did not hit. I'm so glad I'm not stuck in that lightning vortex. Woo! Okay, there's one. Uh... How the hell do I deal with this? Nope, do not run forward into that wander. Actually, come to think of it. Don't we have, like, an item here that's going to make this easier? Lightning defense. There we go. I'm just going to operate under the assumption that it does lightning damage. Okay, should probably actually check if I have a shield. That is lightning defense. Come on. Now if I stand right here, we'll be safe. We just have to stand right there. Well, I can just pump some arrows into this guy until he decides to be friendly. Oh, wait. Nope. Ah, shit. Shit. Okay. Wow, we lucked out there. Okay, so we've got some lightning coming in. Luckily, they don't actually do nearly as much damage as I thought they did. Okay, just back off and go in for the kill. That was far less kill than I was hoping for. This guy hurts. He hurts a lot. I'll just back off. Oh, he's following. Well, that was a pretty embarrassing kill. Either way, <laughs> we're still alive. 
And that's what matters. I'm so glad I got all of those Estus charges. He's just gonna keep doing that to me. Okay, well, we can get a little bit closer this time. That's kind of a jerk. I'll hide behind this for a second. He's probably gonna do the AoE thing. Yep, he is. Ah. The other guys are gonna come along at this point in time. You're kidding me, there are multiples. Well. That's one way to take care of the problem. Please be dead. Nah, shit, it's not dead. Well, I guess I'm just gonna have to take care of this the old fashioned way. As in, stip. Oh! <laughs> this entire place is terrifying. I figured it would just be nothing but fire. But no, there are these weird dickish lightning spirit creatures. Anyway, we left an item back here, so let's grab that. Might as well use a one of these. And the whole, like, teleporting attack strike thing, that's something I wish I had. That'd be so cool. I'd be such a winner. Anyway, looks like the other one is uh, hanging out down there. Not entirely sure what to do with its life. I was really hoping the fall would kill it, and I'd never have to see it again. Oh, looks like those hopes have been dashed against the rocks. Okay, so, what do we got around here? Looks like a structure, looks like a mysterious bow knight, potentially. Let's climb down. I hope I don't have to fight one of those firebow men people. Looks like I have to fight a bowman. Let's go back up. Yeah, thought so. Okay, so we actually have a defense against this. As in, we have a bow. He has a bow. Now here's the question. Can I use line of sight to stime him to the point where he can't do anything to me, but I can do everything to him? That sounds disturbing. Okay, looks like we have a winner. Just gotta, you know, hit him with arrows. Forever and a half. I feel so cheap in this DLC. Like, there's there's, there's no honor amongst what I'm doing here. But then again, if I hop down, I'd have to fight three of them at once. And let's be honest here. That is not a desirable outcome in the slightest. Huh. Well, that guy's just gonna... Okay. Oh, wait. Perfect. Get back here. Get back here, you louse. I said get back here. Well, I mean, I can aim for his cankles. We all know that kind of works. Looks like he's got a buddy with him, too. Buddies and cankling. Cankle arrowing. So for I'm the one doing the cankle arrowing. He's just having his cankles perforated. There we go. There are buddies and cankle perforation. That way it could, uh, the action could apply to either of us. Shit, there are a lot of them down there. I am kind of glad I'm softening them up this way. Otherwise, we would have some interesting party times. Mainly, I do not have the poise or the stamina to deal with blocking that much. Or rolling. Or really anything. This is just easier. Sweet. A uh, couple down. Come on. Nope, he's gone. Okay. Who's left? Looks like I think I'm going to have to snipe this guy. The good old-fashioned way of actually, like, targeting things. Unfortunately, this is not first-person shooter-style controls. Because Dark Souls is awkward and lazy. But, actually, I think the archery thing would be really cool if it had, like, good third-person shooter aim. Because it would be really hard to dodge attacks and stuff like that. Potentially. I don't know. I don't play a whole lot of third-person shooters. I should. It could be fun keep missing him through his things. I expect his hitboxes, you know, keep expecting his hitbox to expand past his actual body. That's not how it works in this game, and I'm kind of glad that's not how it works, because, well, then it would just be cheap and cheesy. Speaking of cheap and cheesy, he's dead. So, who's left? We've got, uh, cankle perforators. Okay, that's the other one. I want to take out, yep. If I can take him out, then I'm going to feel confident enough to go down, probably on my own, and see who's left. As long as one of those weird fire bowmen doesn't pop up, I should be confident here. Let's see. So we've got a fog door, we've got that guy, and I believe we have one of those lightning witches around the corner. Hopefully she doesn't notice me, before, at least before I dispatch this man. Ow. Okay, this is bad. 
Okay. Get stamina back, get stamina back, get stamina back, get stamina back. Beautiful. Okay. Wow. That was easier than I thought it would be. Okay, where are you, Lightning Witch? So I can... Holy shit! Never mind. Never mind. Okay, let's use the wall to our advantage. Ho oh, ho. Bad time to be Estusing, Wander. Bad time to be Estusing. At least this guy doesn't go down in so many hits. Oh, God. Come on, one more strike. And he's dead. Woohoo! Note to self stay full health at all times. You are too weak to be doing this casually. Okay, so we got her on the ropes, actually. How do you feel about a fireball, lady? She does not feel about fireball. Holy shit. She is not feeling this at all. I mean, I don't even know if it's dude or a chick, actually. Okay, shields up. We might have some more. Yep, thought so. One, two, and that was all my stamina. Going for another. Something's making noise. I don't know if it's him or something else. Let's grab this. This entire place is just this cruel creature of abandonment and betrayal and sadness and disappointment and mostly stabbing in the face that I do not appreciate. But we've managed to endure at least this section. Item ahead. Hey, there we go. Soul of a hero. Sweet. I should probably actually use those items. I usually keep them around just in case I need some more souls. Oh, hey, there's another thing over here. Apparently I stomped on that uh, snowman and did not actually bother to grab the soul contained inside. Hey, soul of a great hero. You feel kind of bad about these people. It's like soul of a hero, soul of a great hero. Yet they're just these frozen snowmen on a thing. With no way back to wherever they came from. I wonder if that's going to be my fate too. Probably. Okay, let's continue on. Too many dark thoughts. So, we've got a staircase down. Could be interesting. And we also have a fog door. What's this say? Stay calm and then bonfire... If this turns out to be, like, Smelter Demon Mark II, I am going to be pissed. Okay. Oh. Okay? Okay. Right, and then hurrah for bonfires. Okay. This many people cannot lie to me, correct? God, I hope so. Otherwise, we're going to have some serious problems here. Through this door? It's locked. Damn. What's this? No Scorching Iron Scepter in inventory. So I guess we have to beat a boss before we can get that one open. What are, oh, sweet bonfires. Sweet bonfires of justice. Justice and safety. Okay, let's rest. I really need to increase my stats. So I think what I'm going to do once I'm done with this series is just continually co-op it to death up until the point where I'm actually like a redonkulously high level. And then I can no longer fear anything. So let's go back up and not stick our heads back. Oh, well, apart from this guy. Execution. That didn't kill him, though. Almost killed him. We need a little bit more damage before it kills him. Now he's dead. Ah. We might actually have to fight a couple of these guys, come to think of it. Resting at that bonfire might have been the bad idea. The bad idea. Come on, Iron Knight. I'm just right here. One. Two, three. He's dead. Next up, him. We're probably going to get some more coming out of places we don't want. But you know what? This is good soul farming. Sort of. Maybe the ones that burst out of the snow are only the variety that come up once. I'm hoping. Either way, we've got enough souls to level up once. I am a little bit concerned about things, as in where to go next. Praise the sun. Okay. Yes. I do kind of wish they had put a little bit more effort into, like, seeing f this far off. Oh, well. Okay, so we've got this mysterious area over to the right here. It's more than a little concerning. We also have an item over here that I should probably get first and foremost. Watch it just be a trap. Nope, no trap. Raw stone. Which I believe lets you turn your weapon into a raw weapon, which I don't think we want to do. So, let's go over here. And that looks like a treasure chest. Let's just hope we don't fall off the chain first. We're not going to fly off the handle. Okay. Uh, 
How stupid do I feel? Very, apparently. Up. Oh, holy shit. Uh, Dark Spirit. Meldron of the Assassin. Well, this is bad. Up, oh, and there he is. Sup, dude? I wonder if he's an actual person. Holy crap. He has a lot of health. So in that case, that does not make him a person. That just makes him a Jew douche. I was about to say Jew, and that was not intentional. Okay, so, obviously. We're up against a... Oh, God damn it. We're up against a jerk, obviously. And shields up, shields up, keep backing off. Now, if we keep blocking, we'll be kind of okay here. But, balls. He's using that chariot lance to really great effect here. You'd think my stamina regeneration would be faster than his. Does not look like the case, though. Okay, so if I can get him on the other side of this. Give me another life gem. And then, if I can get around him. Yes, execution move. Not nearly enough health. That was way less than I was hoping for. At least we know we can kind of use his use rotation to our advantage here. But goddamn, his stamina is really intense. At least we can stun him with our light attacks. Okay. Oh, back off. Nope, this is bad. This is bad. We don't, we don't like this. We don't like being here. We don't like you. Oi. Okay, we're very close to death. <laughs> Many occasions here. Ah, but I can use that against him. Beautiful. Backstrikes are lord. Okay, so as soon as he's back up... What the hell is he doing? Oh, bother. This could actually be a real person. Oh, shit. Fuck no. <laughs> How the hell are we supposed to deal with it? Oh, okay. I get it. Sorta. <laughs> well, there's that. Where the hell is the assassin man? Okay, so, first and foremost... Firebombs aren't going to work. We're going to have to take care of this the old-fashioned way. But, if I'm not mistaken, walking down in this area means curses. We don't like curses. Luckily, we can see Mr. Assassin Man come down, so... Oh. Oh, there's that, too. Okay, now let's see if that curse stuff... Yep, that still comes. Well... I don't know what you want to do, Mr. NPC Assassin, dude. I don't know what you want me to do. I guess I'm just going to leave. Watch him come after me after this. Run away! And, um... Might just quit out of the game. Let him deal with it. I don't even, I don't even know if there are consequences for that, but, uh... Wait a second. There's something I can do. Before I run away fully, because I don't think I'm going to want to come back here. Just because he might attack me a second time. Uh, let's get over here. And peer down. Has he come to say hi? I think he's an NPC, considering how much health he has. Let's get over here. And grab this item. Watch it be a trap. Watch it be a horrible, horrible trap. Nope, no trap. And he... Bombfire aesthetic. Great. Just what I needed. Let's uh, peer down here again. And nope. Let's leave. There's nothing over there that anyone would ever want to see. Hope oh, almost fell down. Okay, and you know what? I think with this, I'm just going to escape and see you guys on the next episode, considering we got to another bonfire, which is a great way of cutting things up, generally. So, hopefully he's an NPC so I can actually leave, otherwise we're going to have a problem here. Anyway, see you guys then, and as always, thanks for watching. Uh, please, please be an NPC. Please let me, let me leave. Let me go. Rest of bonfire? Rest of bonfire! Cannot use bonfire. Shit.